All around the world, engineers are developing robots for a number of applications. This involves building machines that can solve certain problems. To make biomimetic robots, the engineers study the animal kingdom, figure out how their skeletal structures and muscles work, and then translate them into servos and actuators. The result are robots that are inspired from nature. Animal robots have evolved from clunky early prototypes to some of the most aesthetically pleasing, occasionally mesmerizing, exemplars of human ingenuity. Check out these awesome robot animals, they're so cool! Flying Fox We love Festo because every year they invest an entirely appropriate amount of time and money into bio-inspired robots that are totally cool and very functional. Festo calls their bionic flying fox an ultra-lightweight flying object with intelligent kinematics. It's 87 cm long with a 228 cm wingspan, but it weighs only 580 grams. Flying foxes are the largest bats in the world, and as such, their wings consist of membranes of skin rather than feathers. The wing is separated into primary and secondary control surfaces, which are mechanically coupled together on the upstroke. The primary folds in toward the secondary and extends back out again on the downstroke. Small motors in the body can adjust each wing separately, while a larger brushless DC motor does the flapping. The robot is autonomous, sort of, in that it flies by itself, but relies on a ground station for camera-based localization. And all of the computing is off-board. Festo uses machine learning to optimize the bionic flying fox's flight behavior, such that every time it performs a maneuver, it gets just a little bit better. Any mal. In 2009, engineers at the Robotics Systems Lab of the ETH Zurich started to develop a four-legged robot that can move autonomously and is intended for use in harsh conditions. Enimal is now capable of running, conquering inclines, and even pressing the elevator button. With laser sensors and cameras, the robot continuously creates a map of its environment, knows where it is and carefully navigates through the terrain. This weighs around 30 kilograms, can carry a payload of up to 10 kilograms, and runs for two hours on a single battery charge. In the future, the robot, which is able to run, jump and climb, could be used for inspections, rescue operations, or in entertainment. Bionic Swift The Bionic Swift is a robot bird inspired by the swallow for general technical education. The experimental kit allows independent assembly of wings and tail unit and is controlled by a radio remote control. Through extreme lightweight construction, the Bionic Swift weighs less than 40 grams and thus demonstrates extremely agile flight behavior as an ultralight flying object. Testing should therefore take place in a relatively windless airspace. The experimental kit contains all materials for assembling and operating the Bionic Swift. The additionally available consumable kit, which includes feathers, glue and carbon rods, allows the wing and tail to be reassembled, thus enabling multiple uses. Robotic Butterfly German company Festo Such robot is referred to as drone hence this butterfly is essentially drone. However, unlike the device with four propellers, Emotion Butterflies is inspired by the nature. The ability to fly is realized by the moving of the wings similar to the real insect. That is really special. The company Festo used such facilities to demonstrate not only the possibility of miniaturization and lightweight construction, but also the ability of a coordinated robot multi-flying. Infrared cameras sense their position and on the basis of the data the movement of each of the butterflies is controlled. Plurobot from the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology. Has a salamander's articulated vertebrae, which lets it easily traverse tough terrain. Thanks to a waterproof exterior and body parts, Plurobot is equally at home underwater just like the real-life lizards this bot was based on. All this, combined with a sophisticated neural network and the individually controllable joints, means this slithering amphibian is a prime candidate for supporting search and rescue missions. Elum. The Norwegian startup Elum has developed a modular underwater robot in the form of a snake, for use in inspections, maintenance, and repair work. 
The slimline, flexible body of the robot can cross vast distances and also reach places that aren't accessible to conventional underwater robots. The engineers have been working on the snake robot for 10 years and keep on developing it further. The plans for its future include keeping it on the bottom of the ocean indefinitely. At a docking station from where it can launch into action whenever needed. The underwater snake is currently still dependent on a cable. But it is already flexible, and its moving connecting parts make it possible to use the snake as robot arm with mounted tools. Maxon Motor supplies brushless DC motors combined with customized gearheads for the connecting modules. Bionicopter Bionicopter is more maneuverable than previous iterations of flying robots. With a wingspan of 27 inches and a body 19 inches long, this dragonfly robot is a great deal larger than the insects which inspired it. But in slow motion, its wings look just like the real thing. Bionicopter can fly forward, backward and stop abruptly in the air. A carbon fiber body covered in blue polyester performance material make Bionicopter a beautiful bug to behold. Spot Mini Dog Spot Mini has a 55-pound dog-like body with a long dinosaur-like neck and head. Mini's interesting design allows it to keep its head stationary while moving its body below. Its mouth is so sensitively calibrated that it can lift a glass from the sink and put it in the dishwasher without breaking it. Distance calculating cameras and a gyroscope let Spot Mini run with the big dogs, including its predecessor Spot. Robert the Robert is a drone developed by Clear Flight Solutions. That is good for controlling other birds. The Robert looks and flies exactly like a real raptor would, which makes the natural birds react like they would in the presence of a real predator. The Robert is used to clear runways from birds so flights can take off safely, and to keep birds away from industrial or agricultural areas. There are two Robirds built, one looks like a peregrine falcon, and the other looks like an eagle. The eagle is an alpha predator, while the peregrine falcon is the most common predator across the world. Clear Flight Solutions chooses which Robert to use depending on the local bird population. Mantadroid Researchers at the National University of Singapore have developed an underwater robot inspired by the manta ray. The manta ray is of interest to engineers because of the way they can effortlessly swim through even turbulent seas. Translating this natural solution to a robot allows for efficient and effective autonomous underwater vehicles. The Mantadroid is fast enough to swim twice its body length per second and can remain active for 10 hours. As compared to conventional propeller-based drones, the Mantadroid promises an extended operating period. Potentially, AUVs like the Mantadroid can be used for underwater surveillance. The team hopes to test the drone in the open seas to see how well it can tackle rough conditions.